Hello and welcome guys. In this video I am going to help you while installing a new operating system in your computer. If the problem is error, you need to load the kernel first then the video is made for only and only you. So continue with the video to know how to solve the problem. I would like to inform you that the video is made in major three parts. The first part shows the problem. The second part shows that how to cure the problem. It means in the second part I will tell you that how can you change the settings to solve your problem and in the third part I am showing that does the setting work or not so without wasting time let's go on the computer screen so guys as you can see I have my HP laptop and I am going to insert the USB flash drive which is bootable to operating system for I am inserting the USB flash drive in my laptop and now I am going to switch on the power button and I have to regular press the ESC key to open the startup menu. Here as you can see the startup menu has been opened. Now I am going to select the third option which is F9 boot device option. I am clicking F9 key and here you can see that there are few options to boot my laptop. You can see in the third option USB hard drive. I am using the key to go through it and I press enter. Now as you can see the process is just starting and a few minutes later it shows me that error you need to load the kernel first. So if you are facing the same problem then I have the solution for this problem. To solve the problem you have to turn off or disable the option of secure boot. So follow the steps which I am going to follow and you will be able to boot your computer to a new operating system through USB live stick by turning off or disabling the option of secure boot. So for that you have to power on your computer and regular press ESC key. Again, and you have to go in the BIOS setup that is F10 so I am pressing the F10 and as you can see I have entered the menu now I am using the arrow keys to move in the menu such as I am in main I click the right arrow to go in security after then I click again right arrow to go in system configuration now I have to use the down arrow and I am going on the last option which is boot option. Now I have to press the enter key. Now you can see that you have to move the options below. Here the security boot is enabled. So what you have to do is turn off the secure boot option to boot your computer to a new operating system for that you have to press the enter key and after that select disable and click enter after that you have to click f10 to save and exit such as i am pressing the f10 and it is asking me to exit saving changes i have to click yes i have clicked and as, as you see the laptop is it is resetting and now it will show me that the setting has been changed on your computer operating system boot setting. So it is saying that if you want to continue with the setting that you have changed, you have to click 6466 and press enter. The code may be different from your computer. I am pressing the 6 and here as you saw the process is completed I am inserting the USB flash drive in my laptop and now I am going to switch on the power button and I have to regular press the ESC key to open the startup menu here as you can see the startup menu has been opened now I am going to select the third option which is F9 boot device option I am clicking F9 key and here you can see that there are 
few options to boot my laptop. You can see in the third option USB hard drive. I am using the key to go through it and I press enter. Now as you can see the process is just starting. I am again click enter. And here you are seeing my laptop screen. As you can see the process of booting my computer to a new operating system has been started. So I thought that the video might be useful to you. If you have any confusion then you can ask me in the comment section I must will reply. Thank you for watching.